Hey there, viewers. Looking to lose weight but confused by the information online? Weight loss is riddled with myths. Most of the tips and tricks you hear lack proper evidence. They might not even work. So what should you do in that case? In today's video, we're gonna share 16 evidence-backed weight loss tips. Why should you drink water before meals? Are eggs and coffee weight loss friendly? Is there any truth to intermittent fasting? We'll be talking about all these and more. Number one, drink water, especially before meals. Drinking good amounts of water is necessary to ensure you remain hydrated. It's also important for your overall health as well. The added advantage of drinking water is that it can help you lose weight. It doesn't, however, mean you can just gulp down gallons of water. Instead, you should drink water before your meals. A study showed drinking half a gallon of water about 30 minutes before eating will help you eat fewer calories. Results of the study also showed that participants lost around 44% more weight than those who didn't drink water. Do you monitor your daily water intake? Do you drink eight glasses of water throughout the day? Share your preferences with the Bestie community in the comments below. Number two, eat eggs for breakfast. While breakfast is often thought of as the most important meal of the day, it's also important to keep track of what you're eating. Research suggests eating eggs instead of a grain-based breakfast can help you reduce your calorie intake for the next 36 hours. It also helps reduce your weight and body fat. Of course, not everyone wants to eat eggs. As long as you can eat a breakfast that's high in protein, you're good. Number three, drink coffee. Do you love coffee? Here's another reason to have more. Coffee comes packed with antioxidants that have various health benefits. More importantly, research has shown caffeine in coffee can improve your metabolism by 11%. It can also increase the rate at which you burn fat by 30%. Of course, it's best to keep your coffee black and not add sugar or other additives. Number four, drink green tea. Green tea already has a reputation for being beneficial in terms of health. However, it's not the caffeine in green tea that helps you lose weight, as it only comes in small amounts. Green tea has antioxidants called catechins that work in combination with caffeine to improve the rate at which you burn your fat. Studies have shown that drinking green tea on a regular basis can help you lose weight. Looking for answers on all the latest health and wellness news? Hit that subscribe button and join our millions of followers. Stay up to date on all our great bestie content. Number five, try intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting is a pattern of eating where you go a few hours without consuming anything and eat only a few hours a day. There are many different types of intermittent fasting, although they rarely suggest what you should be eating. Research suggests intermittent fasting is one of the more effective ways of weight loss. The added advantage is that you don't lose muscle mass, which is seen in low calorie diets. Number six, take a glucominin supplement. Glucominin is a fiber linked with weight loss. It absorbs water and sits in your gut for a longer period. This way you feel full for an extended period of time and reduce the number of calories you consume. A study showed participants that took glucominin lost more weight than those who didn't. Number seven, cut back on added sugar. It almost goes without saying, but added sugar is a complete no-no if you're looking to reduce your weight. It's likely your regular diet contains a lot of added sugar. Research shows sugar increases your chances of suffering from obesity. To lose weight, you'll need to cut back on your daily sugar. For this, you should also start looking at food labels and avoid those with added sugar. Number eight, eat less refined carbs. If you're in the habit of including refined carbs in your diet, all you're doing is eating food that's been stripped of fiber. Research has shown that eating refined carbs actually increases the sugar levels in your blood at a rapid rate. This increases your hunger cravings, which means you end up consuming many more calories. So it's important you reduce the amount of refined carbs you eat on a daily basis. Whatever carbs you do eat, it's best to stick to food with natural fiber. Before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Watch this video to learn more about the seven ways to naturally boost your immune system. Number nine, go on a low carb diet. If you're trying to follow a diet to lose weight, it's best you follow a low carb diet. Rather than stick to low fat, if you follow a plan that reduces the amount of carbs you consume, you'll see greater benefits. In fact, studies have shown that following a low carb diet can reduce your weight by three times the amount of a low fat diet. Number 10, use smaller plates. If you've been trying again and again to lose weight, you've probably heard about eating with a smaller plate. While that may sound weird, research has shown that using smaller plates can help you slim down. Results showed people eating on smaller plates consumed fewer calories overall. This leads me to my next point. Number 11, control your portions. One standard technique people try is counting the calories they consume with every meal. They also try to reduce their portions of food. 
Studies have shown that a food diary is a legitimate method to bring down some of your extra pounds. Some even take pictures of the meals they've eaten to help keep track. As long as you're aware of what you're eating and how many calories you're consuming every day, you'll likely bring down your consumption levels. Number 12. Keep healthy food around in case you get hungry. If you're one of those people who snacks regularly, the best way to beat your cravings is to have healthy food handy. Instead of cookies and chips, you can have fruits, nuts, yogurt, or even hard-boiled eggs. This way, you'll avoid eating too much junk. Number 13. Take probiotic supplements. Research suggests taking probiotic supplements can decrease the fat mass in your body, but you need to be careful as not all bacteria from this family is helpful. There are some forms that can make you gain weight. Number 14. Eat spicy foods. Eating spicy foods can help you lose weight. This is because chili peppers have a compound called capsaicin that can help increase your metabolism and bring down your appetite. So if you were thinking of adding some extra spice to your recipe, now's the time. Number 15. Do aerobics. If you're looking to burn more calories than you consume, doing aerobic exercises is one of the more effective methods. Not only does the exercise help you maintain a calorie deficit, it also improves your physical and mental well-being. Studies have shown these aerobic exercises are particularly effective in helping you lose belly fat. This is usually the most difficult fat to get rid of. Number 16. Eat more fiber. Eating more fiber can definitely help you lose weight. It slows down the movement of food in your digestive system and prevents blood sugar spikes. As a result, you don't have to battle intense hunger cravings. Combine fiber with protein and you have a wonderful weight loss trick on hand. Studies show that eating fiber helps you lose weight by keeping you full for longer. Losing weight isn't easy. It takes a lot of hard work and discipline, but nothing is impossible if you're truly set to achieve a goal. You might be confused about other weight loss tips. Here's what you need to know. Check out which is better for your weight loss, cardio or weights. You can also try 13 healthy food combinations for fast, effective weight loss. Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both and learn more about how to get in the best shape of your life. Are you trying to lose weight? Let us know in the comments below.